hi gems welcome back to yet again another video so today i'm going to discuss the two or three little items that you are going to need when you're making your wigs to actually secure your wig cap onto your head so let's go let's first have a look at what we call wig combs so these wig combs are very very basic right and they come with a bit of like a material piece so these are very good for uh, using when you are sewing so you they must mas sewing machine friendly sorry you can just quickly sew these onto the side right and you I, I ideally always advise that you just buy a packet that has a whole lot inside there's these come in 50s and we sell those for like 200 bucks if you need these also sell like a 10 piece if you also want that so like I said these are mas machine friendly can literally just uh, sew them on the side using your sewing machine the second kind of wig combs that we have right are these these you can't use with the sewing machine you literally have to sew these in with a needle right I like these I love I love how strong they are I feel like they're more durable than these but they're not uh, sewing machine friendly I like something that I can use quickly and readily and just be done okay so the next item that you need is this um, elastic band for securing your your wig on the sides right so this is something that you take I'm just gonna use this when you are sewing your wig you take and place it on the other side either side just for security some people prefer this over your old style uh, it, what, what, what do we call these adjustable bands these thin adjustable bands can sometimes be um, uncomfortable and cause a lot of constriction because they're that thin right so a thicker band is a little bit more comfortable right but it doesn't have to be this thick you don't necessarily have to have a band that this thick you can have it slightly smaller but it's it's better than having these thin um, adjustable bands right it's more secure in that regard so those are the kinds of items that you need to secure your wig like I said you take this and you'd sew it on the inside take your wig cap sew them right there and sew another wig comb over there some people have three so you could use on the sides and at the bottom where you, at the bottom of your nape where your you'd stop your wig or finish up your wig and you'd clip them in there some people don't like wig combs and they prefer like security of the bed and most times we'll use the wig combs and this adjustable elastic band to just allow um, your wig to uh, sit right also with this this is nice to use when you want to uh, have a wig or have wigs that don't necessarily need to be glued down and you want a glueless method this offers you that security and it gives your your wig that secure fit very snug fit so it just holds you don't always have to glue your wig down so that's what i like about these elastic bands don't make it too tight okay don't make it too tight but i definitely recommend if you're looking to make wigs where people can lay their wigs without necessarily having to um glue down their frontals their frontals or their 360s then you definitely need to invest in this kind of material so that you make sure when you are making your wigs they're very secure they fit on properly your measurements need to be right and that your clients are going to be happy so always make sure you have these little small items right they definitely go a long way in obviously delivering a full package wig a wig that fits wig where people can slay don't necessarily need to wonder if it's going to fall off or someone's going to snatch their wig so that's it for today's video let's get into our next video